Hi everyone, so let's talk about walking robot stimulation. So a robot on the infant XY plane start at a point zero zero facing north. The robot can receive a sequence of these three commands. Negative two turn left, 90 degree. Negative one turn right, 90 degree. And K is between one to K and uh, one to nine. Moving forward K union, so one unit at a time. So some sums of grid square are obstacle. The i obstacle is at grid point. Obst obstacle i at equal x i y i. If a robot runs into the obstacle, then you will stay uh, in its current location and move on to the next command. So return the maximum uh, Euclid distance that the robot ever get from the orange square. So uh, okay, north is mean plus uh, plus y, east plus x, south minus y. West minus x. So this is command. This is obs obstacle. So you don't have obstacle in, in this example one, but you do have in, in this example. So this will locate uh, two four, and you just have to know like when you meet at a obstacle, right? You just have to go on the next uh next command. So uh this will be the union you move, and this will uh be the direction you uh you turn right and that would be it so the possible answer i mean the possible comment for the uh for the comments is going to be this right so we just have to make make sure um when we are trying to walk uh we don't actually face the obstacle so here's a way to actually make it easier you just have to use hash set and then to memorize the obstacle movement and whenever you um you walk you you just check the hash set and that will actually cost all of one in the loop right because as hash set is actually um hash index so um, this is it so i'm going to say hash that string that is equal to hash set and for ins, uh, obstacles, in obstacles. So set will add, I'm going to say obstacle zero. So I turn into a string and plus obstacle one. So I'm, um, so when you print out uh the, the the obstacle this will be two four so two four right and this will be the first first obstacle in this example and you have multiple then there will be another situation and i also need a direction right so i uh this direction will keep me uh will keep telling me which direction i have to move since i'm, I'm going to turn left and right Depend on my commands, so I'm, I'm going to say that direct equal to new int, and then uh, the first one will be uh, zero one. This is north, and this will be uh, the east and the south, and last one is west. And that will be it. So I need a direction. So uh, this is will be this D will actually be my current direction. So you can say current D, but I like to use D instead. And also the X Y to record my current position and uh, compared to the origin. Right, you have to get a maximum Euclidean distance. So that's why it's pretty necessary, and also resort, which is the sum of the um, sum of the distance, right? And they just start start looping. So for int c, you can say command in commands, right? You can do at least right if command. So command could be one, uh, negative negative two, 
and then your comment will be negative one. Also, the rest of it, right? So what if the comment is negative two? Negative two is actually uh turning turning left, right? So when you turn left, uh you decrement your d. So d minus minus. And when you turn right, d plus plus. Um this is what I um uh what I like to record my d. So I actually know which direction it's actually facing. And when you get below what below zero, which is negative one, you have to know um you go back to the last directions because when you keep turning turning so when you are facing north when you are facing north and then if you turn um turn left you are facing west and then when you turn again south turn again you are east then when you turn again this will be north right so if the d is equal to negative one and D will become 3. This will be the same idea. If D is equal to 4, D just become uh, 0. So, I need to know um, this, this are the step, right? I need to make sure I'm not actually uh, uh, I'm not actually on the obstacle cell, so well, c minus minus greater than zero. So I'm using while loop to keep walking. So my walking direction will be uh b a zero y plus equal to direction b at one. So this will keep adding the uh, my x y coordinate, right? So I need to make sure I'm not actually uh, facing the obstacle. I'm not actually on the obstacle cell. So a plus set and the set up depends. It's not right. It's not in the headset. So x plus direction d zero. Then then idea y plus direction d one. So when you convert the x coordinate, the new x coordinate, you have to make making sure this x is not equal to this x, this y is not equal to this y, and this will be it. So at the end, you just have to um, just making sure this will be the current maximum Euclidean distance. So result will become max of max and then result and then x times x with uh, plus plus y times y and you just return result all right this is pretty uh pretty long but if you actually follow up right uh you won't get uh you won't get lost so this is 2d array i, I was making mistakes and i made a mistake Again, C, which is comment. Oh, comment. Yes, this will be it. And I pass the test. So let's talk about time and space complexity. The space complexity for this one is all of, all of all right, all of off obstacles. The length of obstacles. And this is actually all of C, all of commands. And for every command, you need to traverse the length of the, uh, the length of the step, which is the maximum is all of nine. So the worst case, the worst case scenario for time, that will become all of C plus, uh, actually time is, time is nine. The length of the C, C become C is actually the length of the C, C length of C, and nine is actually the longest step, which is in the value you have to keep traversing. 
so this will be the uh, the worst case and the content is actually using hash index which is all of one and this will be the time I mean the length of the obstacle is actually shorter than the length of comment for sure right so this will be the worst case for the time and then space is actually um, all of I mean length of the obstacle you don't need the space for the directions and uh, x y resort this will be the uh, local value so space complexity is space complexity is this and all of obstacles then of ob obstacle and this will be the solution and if you feel helpful subscribe if you want it and if you have any question comment below and please don't um forget to like the video and i will see you next time bye